We are Pete and Sophie. This time, another plane. You're really far away from everything. Happy birthday to you. And I got scared. Very excited about that. I'm grumpy. I think it's not working. Welcome under the pines. I can see the sun. Right there. Woohoo! We already drove 830 kilometers and it's just like this. We're driving through the Northern Rockies since forever. The Yukon. It's so far away from everything, from the rest of the world. No wonder that we don't get shipping or fresh groceries. No wonder we don't get any basil or stuff like that up to the Yukon. We're really far away from everything. So it's just like civilization. Then there's the Northern Rockies. And then there's the Yukon. And then there's us somewhere in the Yukon. Both hands on the steering wheel. I oh, know you can hold. Just filled up our blue jug because we don't have water inside. We are in Toad River, which is nowhere, somewhere in the Northern Rockies, but there is gas here. And a school. <laughs> and a school for probably for three kids of all ages. <laughs> because there's just one house, I think, and they sell gas. <laughs> Anyways, we had to get some gas and we paid a lot of money for just a little bit of gas and now we're gonna keep going because we still want to make it out of the snow today. And even though there's not so much snow anymore, there's still snow. And we are on a parking in a parking lot visitor center. So it's not the nicest spot. In Fort Nelson. In Fort Nelson and tomorrow is Peter's birthday. In a few hours. And he's not really happy about this. <laughs> we are in Fort Nelson. It's 1000 kilometers from our cabin. And I think there's only White Horse and then there's Fort Nelson and there's nothing in between. So now we're in Fort Nelson. Pre-birthday dinner. Mm. Happy birthday! How do you feel? I feel good. That's good. Hi Kato! But I'm sick of the winter. Woke up to a white landscape, it's snowing again, it's windy. I woke up super early to prepare the birthday table and to prepare all the birthday things, right? It's a special task to do that in an RV in Fort Nelson. But I think I succeeded and now we can have breakfast! Happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday, Lieber Peter, happy birthday to you. Ooh. Happy birthday to you. It's still a lot of snow, it's Peter's birthday. It's my birthday. So give us a thumbs up for Peter's birthday! Yippee! I hope it will be warmer one day. It looks a lot like winter. Getting groceries, it's still my birthday. groceries and now we will continue our journey. This 
our birthday party. Kato and I are eating rice crackers. Tastes like nothing. So we're having a birthday dinner for Peter. My birthday! <laughs> <laughs> and uh, we want to have a burger for our birthday. Kato! You're ruining my burger. We just left, it's the morning after our birthday. We've been driving for three or four kilometers and I just remembered that I had forgotten to fasten the fuel con containers. I have like four fuel containers in the bag. And I got scared. But for some weird reason nothing has happened. They were all still sitting there, and so I just fastened it down now. I think it's so cool that they probably froze to the thing. So, nothing happened. We're just driving. Mexican lunch in our RV and some cake and coffee and now we're walking the dogs and it's snowing again! Oh. What did just happen? Peter just fell. <laughs> he slipped. I got it on camera. So Peter has Bored. I think I want to eat something out of boredom. <laughs> maybe, maybe a banana first, and then some chips and some candy. <laughs> Looks like we found us a place for some donuts and some coffee. So oh, cold. There's so much snow. It is winter. But it looks cozy in here. So we have our donuts. Okay. Done for today. Yeah. Another well. long day of driving. The sun is shining behind the trees. <laughs> He's telling you the story of our road trip. That's so cute. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay, I guess we will try to figure this out and uh, see you tomorrow. Wanna have some dinner? I'm grumpy. Why? Because Peter is grumpy too and we are grumpy together because we didn't fill up our blue jug. Red sucks. I hate when I don't have water for the night. I don't like that. When you don't have the option to drink during the night. I don't I really don't like that. But yeah. now I'm grumpy. You can see it's grumpy Sophie. Morning. Morning. The sun is shining but it's super cold. Seems to be the story of this trip. 800 and something kilometers to Vancouver. That means like four to five more days on the road. And I feel like I really have to, to take a shower today. So we, the mission is to find a shower.
in the shower. The gas station. The husky gas station. Are you excited? I am. I'm super excited because I really feel like I need one. And it's hot and warm. In the shower. You're good. You're clean. We can continue. had a coffee and I feel super good and do you know what I bought you want to see what I bought just uh, two hours in the city and we're already spending money for this is so nice. stuff we don't need I need that <laughs> and it's so nice it's so fluffy and now I can clean Sophie is buying groceries, Kato is sleeping, and I just took out our door lock. There she is. Yeah. Apparently she already noticed the hole in the door. What did you do? I took out our door. The hole in our door. Yeah, because we couldn't lock it, and now we have to fix it. I think I'm putting in the door lock. There's a lot of pieces that come with it. But I'm, I want to get to Vancouver, so I'm not going to waste my time reading through any stupid instructions. I should. I'll just use a hammer, huh? I'm not sure. <laughs> that this will fit. I think you ruined our door. Well, I think you might be right, but... No, we have no door in Vancouver. We have a door. Open house. <coughs> don't need it. I don't need it. I think it's not working. I think it's not working. I fixed it. Woohoo! We can now lock the door from the inside and the outside. That's fancy. watching we hope you enjoyed watching our vlog and please consider subscribing that would be amazing yes and please hit the like button yes and please leave a comment we love to read your comments we do have a patreon page as well oh yes we do we do have a <laughs> patreon page <laughs> i don't know why <laughs> The link is up here! And, and yes, and we do have a thank you button. It's down here. So, Patreon up here. Thank you down there. Don't tell anyone. And we have to thank our new patrons. Yes. Thank you so much, Eric. Thank you, Johnny. Thank you, Anthony. Thank you, Gary. Thank you so much, Abed Ismail. We love you guys and please consider subscribing that would be great and give us a thumbs up and we see you next time love you see you next time hello everybody also just like got a few like cool and like you know like brudie es geht brudie es ist mal fun neue kiste you are bamboozled